Queen has convened a meeting of all four royal households to try and find a workable future role for the Duke and Duchess of Sussex within days, not weeks. Her Majesty in Sandringham, Prince Charles in Scotland and Prince William have been locked in a four-way conference call with Prince Harry in Windsor to try and resolve his and Meghan's exit from the royal family. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex revealed yesterday that they want to quit public life, though it later emerged the announcement came against the Queen's strict orders. The Queen wants the situation resolved as quickly as possible, according to a Buckingham Palace source this evening, and talks will take place at pace and involve the government, including Home Secretary Priti Patel. Discussions may even include foreign governments, possibly Canada and the United States, with Harry and Meghan intending to split their time between the UK and North America in the future. Despite presenting their exit as a done deal, the palace warned the couple last night that their plans were at an early stage and much discussion was still required between the royals, suggesting that Harry and Meghan had jumped the gun and ignored the rest of the royal family's wishes. Prince Charles and Prince William only found about the bombshell decision ten minutes before it went public. It has threatened to trigger an all-out war with Charles and William reportedly incandescent with rage at Harry and Meghan and the Queen thought to be deeply disappointed. The Duchess of Cambridge's 38th birthday was also completely eclipsed today after the Duke and Duchess of Sussex announced their nuclear plans last night. Courtiers have warned that Harry and Meghan will be punished for ignoring crystal clear orders from Her Majesty not to go public until the proposal was finalized by senior family members, including his father. 